Watching the two of them become best friends has been the best part of this journey. I met Lily on Stephen's 23rd birthday. She came to Stephen's party in the company of our old friend Abby Muir. I believe my role for the night was supposed to be that of an interrogator, but due to my obtuseness, that wasn't exactly going to happen. It didn't matter, however, because Lily was perfect. All of you, every single one of you, is one of two things. You are one of our closest friends, or you are part of our family. Stephen and Lily, are you prepared to enter marriage freely and wholeheartedly? I am. I am. Stephen had me over to his house. His room was like any other middle schoolers. He had a desktop computer, a customized bunk bed with a bench press replacing the bottom bunk, and an overflowing closet cachet of claymores, ninja stars, battle axes, and other assorted medieval weapons. I remember thinking only one thing, now this is a man. She went on a first date with a guy named Steven, stayed up all night talking, and as I got to know Steven, I realized how easy it would be to stay up all night talking to him. He's welcoming, funny, and has great stories. and opinionated people realized that the way to be best friends is to challenge each other and be exciting. To be two unique individuals that complemented one another. Lord, we thank you for the friends who are here tonight to celebrate with Lily and Stephen. These friends have made personal sacrifices to be here. I can hide the rest you. Won't you just be my ray of sunshine? Lily, really take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. Stephen, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and Son, and the Holy Spirit, and of the Holy Spirit. Kiss the dog. God, Lily and Stephen were united together today in love. Let their love grow and flourish. <laughs>